sometimes it's like they're just circling around you. I know. Oh. I think that would be like the sick people. Uh, they seem to the most uh, uh, Of course organized. the sick people would. Not the naked people. <laughs> well, they were well, they're kind of just uh, on the, the ground. The naked people are just waiting for you to get up there. <laughs> yeah. I'll put my jacks on. Well, you can. Yeah. I'll remember that. <laughs> <laughs> And then in here, there seems to be an argument between two dead people. The aggressive guy and the passive guy over there. Um, and he's more aggressive and active and does more stuff. Is he just staying in here? Yeah. He's just mostly back there. And then that guy over there, he's little. And then I think he did jump from over there to over there and wanted to push people down the stairs. <laughs> and. Um, you want to go over there? I think that's fine. So, yeah. <laughs> But I'm not open. This I is for not science. Open. I'm trying to see it. So very... What are they arguing about? I don't know. I want people to do EVPs and get it on on, uh, on uh, tape. That's what I want. Yeah. I'm confused. Okay, so, um, all right, y'all heard that, right? <laughs> um, so if you go over in that area, um, be careful, because, um, you know, the guy wanted to throw people, you know, he's coming down, there's another stairwell over there that goes up, and he kind of rushes down from there and tries to, to push people down the stairs, so be careful. Um, there's a guy that was back there, and he's been making noises and whatnot on and off uh, tonight, and he's a little bit more aggressive. So if you want to do EVPs back in there, take photographs back in there. Um, and like I said, there's, it'd be great if somebody could do EVP session and try to get those two to like converse or figure out their shit. That'd be awesome. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I think those, that, those areas are familiar. There was one guy who was bumping around and there was a woman, but I haven't seen them in a while, so I don't know what the heck. But honestly, the most active area is over there, mm. by far. Yeah. By far. Incredibly, incredibly layers and lots of dead and uh, lots of residual, so. Yes, it is. Hmm? Did you go back into that room? I haven't been all the way. I haven't because every time I go in, I get something else <laughs> that stops me. I haven't actually been all the way to the back yet. So, and I actually had to remove myself a little while and stop from vomiting. So, <laughs> do you think the room was it, or was it just other things? Uh, that was when I ran into a bunch of sick people. Who in were, here. Hmm. Did you run into them in here? In the attic area, I guess that's what they're calling it. Right, the attic. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. I did. Yeah. I just said, I was just listening. Interesting. Because, okay, thank you. <laughs> there was, there I was the guy who was horrible. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, okay. <laughs> I appreciate you telling me Oh, okay. Wait, no, what happened? <laughs> oh, no, I just, I, um, I heard people talking to her. I, some people I was with um, not long ago were saying that they thought that it seemed, it felt like a um, sick, sick ward. Or they felt like maybe um, there was a lot of people in there at once or something like that. So, I don't know. It's a shit load of people in there. Um, but the sick people, what I just found out is, or what, was that there was some kind, somewhere in here above us, I guess? Was like uh, confirmed? Yes. Or, yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. Yeah. So I'm thinking that, you know, because that was the third time I went in there, mm -hmm. and there was a whole group, and they were just sitting there crying and freaking out and saying how they just let us fucking die. They just let us fucking die. So I don't know what the fuck went on, but <laughs> I'm thinking they were even cared for. Yeah, oh yeah. Just because, like, that's, and then the first guy was horribly murdered and sexually you know, so there's a lot going on in there. That's not um, where I go all the time, just because it seems like there's always something in there. That's why I'm just mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah it's, it's just crazy. Crazy in there. Yeah. 
So you, <clears throat> so you said you haven't opened yourself up? No. But no. you can still feel and see all that? Well, it's much, at much more of a distance, except for the one guy who was wrongfully murdered. Um, he was much more um, present and making a point of making contact. So with him, I did get physical issues, but I'm able to disengage much faster and like shut them down and remove it from me much uh, quicker than if I'm open. Okay. Um, and also I just get more general impressions like then if I'm open, then I'm fully engaged and I'm having complete conversations, seeing them fully. So it's like a much, it's distance. At a distance. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, except for that one guy. Woo! What did you say about over here? Uh, there okay. was a passive guy over there who's afraid of that guy. <laughs> <laughs> so I wanted to know, like, what their what the issue is there between them. Well, when we were walking in, I guess I was the only one that heard it. We were kind of just all coming in here initially, and I thought I heard somebody back in the corner somewhere go, go pss. And I, I guess I was the only person that heard it because I looked oh, around and nobody else and heard it. Immediately, you started talking about that. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> 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 no, I am not going back. Oh, oh, I, was gonna, I was going to ask no. you. I was uh, going to ask you earlier. Have you ever been physically attacked by a demon? Uh, yes. I figured you probably had since you deal with this so much. Yes, I have. But it's just something that's pretty rare, I would think, or what? Yes. Mm -hmm. I mean, yes. I've done a lot of ghost hunts and all that. I've never ran, ran into anything I, I thought was demonic or anything like that, you know? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I've talked to a lot of ghost hunters that's never ran into anything demonic. Right, right. You know it what is I'm rare. And, like, when I, before doing the show, mm -hmm. I could, like... Although, I mean, I was called in on some bigger cases that had, but it always, typically it was always a really fucked up dead person mm -hmm. that was going ape shit and causing problems. And like, people would confuse it with a demonic yeah. presence because they were being so vile. And there's grumpy spirits. Yeah, but I've noticed an increase uh, over the last few years of, of negative energy. Hmm coming forward. Why, why do you think that is? I, 